Welcome to our lecture online. Now here we have an equation that's a little bit more difficult to deal with, especially when they're asking us to solve that for b. So how do you approach that? Well, there's a number of ways, but since we are used to multiplying both sides of the equation by the lowest common denominator, we may want to start there. We could also get rid of the k by moving the k down there, but let's not start with that. Let's go ahead and use our general approach. We're going to multiply both sides with the lowest common denominator, so we first need to find the lowest common denominator. In this case, the LCD is simply going to be the product of the two denominators, a times b. So that's what we're going to do. Multiply the left side by a times b, and then we're going to multiply the right side by a times b. That will at least get rid of those fractions that makes it a little bit easier to deal with. Okay, on the left side, we have a, b times w equals k times, on the right side, a, b times 1 over a, the a's cancel, because what we're doing here is we're multiplying this by both of these fractions here, so the a's cancel, we're left with a b minus, here the b's cancel, so we're left with an a. So at least what we've done here is gotten rid of the fractions. Now let's get rid of parentheses by multiplying this through. So we have a, b, w equals k times b minus k times a. And now since we're solving this for b, we need to move all the terms of the b to one side and leave everything else on the other side. So we have a, b, w minus k, b equals minus k, a. Now notice we have two terms here that have b in it, so we can factor out a b. So b times aw minus k is equal to minus ka. And now we're going to divide both sides, whoop, here we go, both sides by aw minus k, aw minus k. So this will cancel this out, so we're left with b is equal to minus ka over aw minus k. Now you may not like that negative there, I don't like it, so I'm going to multiply both the top and the bottom, the numerator and the denominator, by a negative 1. That means that b is therefore equal to a k, because I like to write a before k, divided by, flip this around, k minus a w. And there we go, there's the final result where we solved for the variable b out of that equation. And that is how it's done.